My name is Roz Flanagan, I come from County Armagh. I was 20 when I got married, just couldn't wait, just wanted to get married, it was one thing I always wanted to do and have a family. I'm the mother of four beautiful girls, whom I'm very proud of. I had my first daughter when I was 21, then two years later, to the day nearly, I had my second daughter, Victoria. Then after the two girls, I had a gap of like five years and I have to say probably Stephanie was the one that actually was properly planned. Then after that, Monika came along seven years later. To a big surprise, but a very nice surprise. Have you thought anything about getting the clear, the clear braces? I'll see, I'll look at them both. I'll look at the normal ones and the clear ones, but like, I kind of have my mindset on the, just the normal ones. I was 16 when I met Vincent, yeah, very young, but no regrets. We got on very well, very compatible. When I was just 21, we built a house, County Monaghan, Castle Blaney. That was fantastic for me because I just wanted to have my own home and have my own space. I'm so sad to see the girls all growing up and leaving home. My eldest daughter, Melissa, has already moved out. Stephanie's studying acting in New York and she's a college there. Vicky, yes, she's talking about moving out. I don't want her to. I'm still dealing with that, so we'll leave it at that. Virginia invited me along to the Calendar Girls because she was going with Lisa and Joe, whom I had never met. Then she rings me last minute, she wasn't feeling well, but she says, Ross, you could pop in anyway. I, I kind of would have known Lisa a little bit from a few lunches and things like that, but um, I just went in and said, hi, I'm Roz, and um, met Joe that night as well. So it was really good to meet uh, Joe as well. Does that look gorgeous? You look gorgeous. Thank I love you. your dress, Ross. Oh, Beautiful. Thank you. 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 Thank you too. Listen, guys, Virginia's not going to make it. So I, I did say that. Yeah. 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 Well, I, I know. I know. She was looking forward to it. She's really thinking yeah. that she would. Yeah. How do you know her? Do you I've known her quite a while, you know, but um, got to know her more down in Mabea um, in Spain because she's a place and her father has a business down there and my husband knows <laughs> oh, her right, father okay. and all. Yeah. So, How long are you married, Ross? 28 years, on the 17th. Roz is a very warm, kind, loving lady, and uh, that speaks volumes. 28 years married, you know, and, and four beautiful, beautiful daughters. What's the life of 28 years? Um, we just get on really well and uh, enjoy it. It works. Life. And it works. When I first met Roz, I thought she was very quiet, very timid. I didn't think there was a bubbly spark in her. But as I went on talking to her with Lisa, she does so much fun in her. You having your girly nights and him having his nights. Well, it won't Maybe better. now, but whenever, I suppose, whenever the girls were younger and stuff like that, yeah, like sure Vincent would have been in Dublin and I was in the country and hardly knew anyone. Dublin, and he was working, starting his business up in Dublin. Right. So it was really lonely. Out. She's just a little lady, you know, not quiet, but you know, she's just ladylike, you know, really nice. Jo is just fun. She's like da 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 and, and fun. Totally different, uh, different mannerism altogether, but just as nice and is fun. This is new for me now because I haven't even seen the movie. Calendar I, Girl. Yeah, I did. I, I remember no the way it was filmed. Oh my god. Yeah. I enjoyed the film, like I have to yeah. say. And it's very tasteful, even though they're naked, it's it's very oh, tasteful. It's very yeah. well done. The way you did it, though, it's fantastic. Yeah, it is, it's and will they be naked tonight? Imagine. <laughs> they'd be holding two big huge tomatoes and then cupcakes. Just, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you well, you, you'd need melons for me. <laughs> no. Brilliant. <laughs> The last thing I need is a flipping man with a brain. That's the last thing. Yeah, but you don't want to be dating Morsel Gummidge uh, with nothing inside.
Lisa and Ross had invited me to the Calendar Girls opening night in the Grand Canal, and I was, I was excited to go just to see if I could do it. So I told her, yeah, I'll be coming down. I had the clothes ready and everything, and I just I couldn't bring myself to even put on like a lipstick. I didn't have the energy to do that, so um, I kind of stood them up. Yeah, this is the baby's head here. Oh. <laughs> uh, okay. So cute. Oh, Perfect. Oh, I can see the heart, yeah. Well, now that the time is getting closer, I can't wait to be a mother. I can't wait to hold this bundle of joy and um, just made out of love. It's a part of me and a part of the man I love. I, I just, I can't wait to experience that. I'd say I'll get so emotional when, when I meet him for the first time. Hopefully you have an easy vaginal delivery. So you happy? Yes, very happy. Very good. As long as you drug me up, doctor. <laughs> very good, okay. <laughs> I'd love to see a profile shot though, is he? He's turned around, is, he's turned around though, is he? The problem here, Kenya, is that it, it, the hand is actually up beside the face. So he's camera, he's camera shy. Yeah. So he doesn't take after yeah, me then. Normally if we're looking at 3D scan. <laughs> I know I've waited so long to, to have a baby, but I, I, I have never felt so ready and I'm so in tune and I'm, I just can't wait to experience and uh, to, to experience it and I, and I just I hope to be the best mother that I can be. I've been nagged so much recently about the fact that, you know, I only date international rugby players and I'm just getting a lot of stick to go meet a date.